name is Ahmed Haji. I uh, thank you, Dr. Besiji. Uh, my question is uh, in line with uh, the huge majority of uh, the populace, who are the young people. And uh, over time, we are the majority, but uh, we're facing one of uh, the global disease that has trickled into our country, youth unemployment. It was evident enough during the September riot. Try to run down, you know, find out who were the victims are the young people because they are desperate. Uh, what are you going to do as IPC once we push you into government? Because we have the muscle. 60% of the voting About blockers. unemployment. Exactly, youth so unemployment. Very clear interventions which are in our manifesto. One, which is direct benefit, once you deal with the corruption and uh, wastage in the government and the resources go back to get invested in the society, that in itself creates jobs. You know, if the 500 billion or more of Chogam had been invested in the society, if we had built schools, a school can be built with 200 million. You could have built 2,500 schools with just Chogam money alone. Now, apart from solving the problem of education, the jobs that would have been created by constructing 2,500 schools are enormous. So if by just, by, <laughs> so by, by just switching back money that is either stolen or misused, Again, the amount of money that is misused is one of the areas we want to tackle. You know, the huge government, 70 ministers, for what? We want a small government that is efficient so that money goes, so that money goes back in society and creates jobs and services. Secondly, our view is that the tax regime in Uganda is too high. Taxes kill jobs. Because once taxes are too high, it means that the cost of commodities and services are going to be very high. Once the cost of commodities and services are very high, it means people will not buy. Once people don't buy, it means they will, people will not produce because there is no market. And so there will be no jobs. So if you cut taxes, you cut prices, you increase consumption, you increase jobs. And they are, they are, we, we are also talking about government intervening in itself in production. Uh, but m again, maybe there is no time to go into, into all that. But there are clear interventions which we are proposing in our manifesto.